All righty, we're just trying to get back to it. Welcome back. We're going to get back at it. It's just nice outdoors. Oh, beautiful. We got the doors open today. Woo! Don't even feel like doing anything, to be honest with you. But you know what? If I didn't, I would feel guilty. I would feel guilty. And I know that. So that makes me want to get back at it. Come look at this side here, if you don't mind, sweetheart. Jolene looks fabulous today. Come look at this side here, if you'd like. That side over there sort of seems to be, it was the worst side, I guess. Uh, th there's none more different than the other. They both need the same amount of work. But what I'm trying to say is there's no sill on the outside of that one. That does not bother me. Um, the reason I fixed this side first is because we had a little bit more of the sill and there was more cut out here in the back. Like that piece for the back seat was not in there. So I just made the floor. Um, and that's the choice I took. On this side over here, we're going to prepare it the same as this side. I'm going to take a jack and put it underneath the door on that side. Just not going to make it go in the air. I'm just going to have it there so it holds it. I'm going to go in there and start cutting that out. And basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut out the shape that I have right there. And then I'm going to square tube it like I did before. And uh, so that tells you that if you see a car that looks like that, you do not have to be scared of it. You do not have to be scared of it. You can just walk and say, I can fix that. Uh, we got the fender done. Uh, I forget his name. Um, what I have done here, I've done the basics, what I always do. 40, I don't know why I was switching my head around like that, what I was looking for, but I was looking for something. Uh, 40, 80 on the, on the filler, and then we went to the primer. Uh, then we filled the pinholes, and then we guide coded it. So that's basically what's going on there. I just wanted to show you how I did, what I did with the underneath of it. With the repair, we put this piece in here. If you don't remember or seen this video, we made the piece that fits here where the tire used to be. When I cut it out, when I cut it out, I, I left the half inch that was all the way around there that that butt welded to. And the reason I left it because it kept structure to the fender when I was putting my piece on. Um, as this is where I put the piece on. So I, what I did is I just seam sealed where I butt welded together and seam sealed where it was welded around the edge. And that's basically it. Um, this was a fender that did not get the piece. It got the patch. <laughs> just like that. It give up smoking and got the patch. So that's how I'm going to give that back to the, the man that owns that. I'm happy to have that done. And I hope it satisfies him. And I'm sure it will. Uh, right now I'm going to go inside the car. And I am going to start cutting because that's what has to happen. Watch yourself through here. That's what has to happen. So that's where we're going to go. I just got in, I just got in a mo mode here. I got to take off and get into having a knot. Um, I got to cut a bunch of stuff out of here. I didn't pull the jack around yet, did I? I'm going to pull the jack around first. Didn't get my knee pads on. I don't know why I busted right into work, though, but I dropped that fender and busted right into it. get into her and it, as I see as I see I got this this side in here the piece that goes along back for the seat the square piece that goes over the side you can see where it is and you can see where it was attached to our support on our quarter panel the seat underneath the seat brace right here and I'm talking about this piece right here that's a seat that's where the seat sat down on um, you could bend a piece of metal up on the old brakey poo poo over there and set it down on there and weld it to that floor very, very easily. Jim was talking about wood. Uh, that, that could be very easy too, but to make it look professional or, you know, halfway is more decent, I, you could put a piece of metal in there. I'm just going to tow this over there. We don't get a whole lot of nice, well, we get a, a few nice days, and let's, let's, let's get real now, but we don't get a whole bunch of nice days. So when we get a bunch of nice, or nice days here in Nova Scotia, it really brings you alive. <laughs> Doesn't it? Baby, I find it does. Brings me alive. And I'm just going to put that underneath that door like that, and that's basically it. And I'm hoping that's going to hold, just going to hold it there. That's all I'm doing. Not jacking it up, not moving it, not doing anything, just holding it. I'm going to cut a bunch of stuff off.
use I want to use this grinder disc up is what I want and uh, that's not letting me do it Now I feel better about the grinder disc. I got her used up. I feel better about it now. <clears throat> Just gotta get some cut and get some stuff out of the way. And basically I don't wanna move anything. Everything's fitting okay, the door's fitting all right. The roof is really holding the car together. I think I said yesterday, the roof is holding the self the car together, so we're fine. Uh, the front, there must be a front mount above the, the tow board, but it's, hold in place very well and uh, if it gets out of place a little bit just put it back in place I guess basically that's about it it's a nice big piece to have out of the way isn't it <laughs> did a beautiful job taping up the back windows. Did you unplug that, sweetheart? She kick out on you? Yeah. It kicked out on you. I don't know. Can I push the button? All right. If it's working on one, I don't understand what's going I'm not sure. She got this place lit up in here. And okay. No worries. No worries. She's just trying to have it lit up so everybody can see what's going on. I'll hold that if you like. There you go. Just, just like my microphone sometimes. That's how easy it happens. Take this right outdoors. <laughs> just keep saw. That makes it better to stand in here actually, doesn't it? Makes it better to to work in. Come on, baby. See where they're rotten, you think they want to come apart easy, but they don't. They don't. swinging hammer but whatever work for now a little teeny thing huh probably hurt myself with it there that's what I was talking about that's what I want I'll dig that stuff out of there I'm gonna save that washer what the hey this piece here this is the where the bottom of the fender bolts on on the other side, on the inside sill, we ran it up far enough that the inside fender can bolt on there. I'd like to cut that one off. 
I'm gonna cut it off and run a new one where it can bolt on like we did on the other side. Well. Was no good anyways. Just take a minute, rip her off here. Well, so far I'm two and zero on naming songs. <laughs> Here, I'll say it. Icky Breaky Heart by Miley Cyrus. <laughs> That'll give someone a question, an ant, or a comment, right? Get me more comments. Uh. Jolene cheering me on. She give me a yay. Yay! And we're just trying to get this out of the way. That's kind of stuff in the way. Right on. Let's cut this out of the way. Watch yourself, sweetheart. Yeah. Ah, geez, hit that, put a hole in just like that. Waste this disc for some reason. I do not want to waste this disc. Let's cut this one out. I wonder if she's gonna fall when that comes out. It looks like it's connected a little bit, but we'll find out. there all right I think this is where the plasma cover cutter is going to come out to get in there to cut that off can't get the grinder in there or else I'd use a grinder I shouldn't put my hand weight on that one there I gotta change this grinder disc and I'm gonna try to get get that cut off I use a little bit more of this I guess Waste not, want not. Yoo! Whenever she kicks, I just give a scream like that because pretend I'm at the rodeo, right? Yoo! That's when she kicks. Alrighty. Let's get this one cut off. Oh, she's good. Love her. Love her. That's you, I mean, Jolene. That's you, baby. She got the baby blue shirt on today. Don't mess Jim's interior up. <laughs> yeah, I'm just joking. Jim said only to work on the car if you're having fun. I'm having fun. <laughs> having fun. Yay! One for Chatty. One for Chatty. Look at that now. Look at that mess, would you? Hickory dickory dock. Jim didn't want that anyways, did he? Jim didn't want that. I know he didn't. Could leave that mount. That's, yeah, we'll put a new one in for him. We'll make him feel extra special. 
I'm gonna cut that one off. Doing the old. Spot in the back here, cut her off. I'm gonna screw Jim's tire up either. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yay! All right, that's still in place. Still in place. Look, it's right there exactly where it was before. Nothing's happened, nothing's moved. That's where it was welded on. This hasn't moved yet. So we're doing good. We're doing good. All righty, I'm gonna get the plasma cutter, cut that off. Get that cut out. Plasma cutter, plasma cutter, plasma cutter. Ooh. It's already out. I wonder if I can, I'll leave, leave it on this side, I think. Just talking to myself, so I'm gonna leave it on this side. That way there, I might be able to run it through and leave less cords on the other side, I'm hoping. That floor is nice and strong. Now, just need some air. We need some power. Glasses are good for short, close distances, but long distance, it's, I can't see. I'm like Mr. Magoo. I wish I had his car. <laughs> Mr. Magoo had a Model T, didn't he? I think so. He drove a pot pot. Mr. Oh, Mr. Magoo. Mr. Magoo. I gotta get that plugged in with air. Do, 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 do. Don't let the rotten cars, don't let them scare you. And what I, what I like about them the best is that when you go look at a rotten car like that, all the stuff that is missing is all the stuff you don't have to cut out, the less you have to cut out, you know. Um, to put a car back in position, put it, to put a car back in position when it's together sort of, it's kind of like that. Jack it up, get your doors, get your doors in place. Tack them on, give yourself a door gap, get your doors in place and jump in and start making things. When you're all done, jump out. That means going in through the front window or the top window or whatever, get your doors in place, put your, all your doors in place, weld them shut, get in there, square tube it around the inside, make that long piece for that sill and get that connected. Do the same on the other side and get a structure going. Cut your door shut, you should be fine. If you have any issue at all, you know how to cut that back and tab it back, or you can put a different, bigger mount in the back to bring it up to, to open it up. But do not be scared of something that doesn't look right. And the way, the first thing you do to try to get something look right is to get that door fit. Get that door fit. Get that door to fit. And then the rest will follow. Is that smoke coming out? Is that dirt or dust or what's going on? I got something on fire here. I got something on fire. I know I do. Huh? That's how easy. You can, like that's how easy it goes, man. Weld something like that and then walk in the house or even didn't weld anything yet. Hit it with a grinder and then walk in the house. You could have hell of a time. Might be living outdoors. As long as I got Jolene, I'd be happy. 
Oh, she got smoke inhalation, boys. She got smoke inhalation. Cut the video. I got her go. That's all right. No, I'm just joking. I just take this outside and step on it for a second. There. There. All right, back in order. Plasma cutter. Is, it, is the green light on that thing, baby? Green light on that? Green light on that? All right, here. <coughs> That is choky, isn't it? <coughs> <coughs> that choked me up just as soon as I walked in. It filled me up. Yeah. Alrighty. Scrape that off. Pull that off. Ha ha! That worked out good. Alrighty, I'm just gonna set that there. Set that there. I'm gonna take that off before I get going too far. I'm gonna have to take it off sometime. Just trying to straighten everything up. See where I'm going here. Just trying to straighten everything up. What I'm going to do first is, I guess, and it goes down like that. Let's get that square tubing in from here all the way along to the back. Let's get the measuring tape going. Stay off the tunnel. Kind of a hard place to move, but let's go for it. 
There's where, the, there's where the fender bolt's on, right to the end of there, and that's where I'm going to go to, right to the end of that. Eh, I might even go a little bit further. See what happens. Get on there. Err! My glass is playing tricks on the air. <laughs> Do you like that, sweetheart? Just trying to get underneath this piece. Seventy, I'm gonna say seventy-three. Seventy-three. So I'm gonna say seventy-three or seventy-four. It doesn't matter. It does not matter. I'm gonna go seventy-four. You can always cut it off. Oh, the sun is nice. The sun is nice. I've told you I'm going to set the other the storage containers up. we got a cutout over there. I'm going to set them up with a few cars. And this is some of the gear that I'm collecting, like the drill press there. This is, believe it or not, this is a shear. <laughs> shear metal in that. That's a shear. And I'm going to put some, like the louver press in there. And I'll put a few cars in there. That's what I'm going to try to use some, put some old school tools in there. Probably the tools I would never, ever use. But they'll look some good sitting in the corner with the old cars, I bet you. That's what I'm going to do. What the hey. And, you know, they weren't big money. They were just probably tools that are going to be here until the end of time. And I might as well look after until the next fella. I might as, well, might as well look after the next fella. Basically, I'm just going to get in here. There's no set place where this is going to fit. No set place whatsoever. Um, that, I shouldn't have said that. There's no set place where I'm going to weld it on and say it's perfect. No. I'm going to put it on wherever I can tack it to make it stay in the place I want. Then we'll call it. I want that to... hmm. When I set this up in here, there's a little there's a little thing right there. I'm setting it on top of. Set it on top there. When I bring it back here, um, I can get it fitted nice back here, but it just wants to drop down here some. So I'm going to cut that down. Say, I'm going to cut that down. Probably the length of this square tubing because it's sitting on top there now. I'm going to cut that down a little bit and let that sit down on it. Get down on it. I'm going to do that with the this bad boy. I'm glad that was plugged in. That makes me happy. See if I can set it in that hole. That would be nice. That would be nice. No. Turn that up. Just, just got to get a little bit cleaner, that's all. in some
that's what you get for jamming her in there, I guess. Should have grabbed something maybe, but no, I'm happy with it. That's what happens sometimes. Don't be scared, just go with it. It wasn't, it wasn't doing what I wanted it to do, man. So I jammed it in there. You know what they say. <laughs> it's funny, you know, I always say, I only do what my brain tells me to do. I learned that off a five-year-old kid, I think. I said, why'd you do that? And he said, I only do what my brain tells me to do. <laughs> it, fit, it, it was so, so much the truth that I laughed and learned something. I only do what my brain tells me to do. And uh, I said, why'd you do that? Oh, I only do what my brain tells me to do. <laughs> I got to knock a, that little tit off there, and then I can weld that right on that edge. Get that up in the, and then the back. I'll worry about it when I get there. And I got to get that little tit off. I think that's her, boys. Yeah, I only do what my brain tells me to do. There we go. Now I can weld that right on the side of that. I'm happy with that. Or I'm happier. Yeah. Nope, it's not where I want to be. I want to be right there. Got her in place. Ah! Got to cut a few things off to make it go a little better. What's that, sweetheart? My cord is hanging from my sound. I'll try to fix it, sweetheart. Am I unplugged? I don't think so. She's straight up. That one goes straight up, that one. Like I said, we have so many different mics, it's hard to point it all down. Technical difficulties yesterday, and uh, we're going for a fix today. We'll see what happens. God bless her. I feel for her when it happens. She like she gets mad as she gets mad. She wants to do the best she can do at all times, ain't you, baby? My baby wants to do the best she can at all times, and sometimes it doesn't work out that way. When you get the old sound of me climbing in and out of a car, and you know, if we were doing TV, it'd be cut. Get him in here. You know what I mean? There'd be none of that, and you wouldn't get to see. Alrighty, I'm gonna turn the welder on. Let's get a piece in there. Whoop, whoop. Almost did a catwalk with that thing. Got the sweat rolling down today. We will get hotter this summer. We will be sweating. Um, I don't know if I'd like the 100, 100 degree weather all the time. I don't know if I'd like, to get, like that all the time. I think it'd be a lot of swamp ass and I'm just not into that so much a lot, but uh, that there. Six and a half. Turn her on. Open her up. Let's stick her in there. Call her Howdy Doody. <laughs> Sometimes, sometimes hard to get in and out of here. And like at all times. I should have got a pair of vice grips I was in out there. Damn it. No, I just said there should be some right on top of the car there. Should be. On that side there. A pair right there, sweetheart. If you'll get them for me, sweet. That'd be, that'd be great. No, yeah, them pair too. That'd be great. What a nice day it is out. Doot, doot. Be nice to have a, a dirt track around for the older cars, not get get in that competition stuff. It'd be nice just to go around and make lap times and see who can make the you know make the fast lap time. Once you start into making a, a competition and all that sort of stuff, and then, then you start getting people getting hurt. Uh, if you ran ran around had lap times, that'd be fun, if you know what I'm trying to say. Like run around who can make the fastest lap. I mean, that's basically the end of the story. Who's Who's the, who's the driver and who's not, isn't it? 
lap times? I think. I'm not sure. I don't know shit. I don't know shit. All right. Well, that's where I want a welder. Now, I don't know if it's going to stay there or not. But... I got the ground on it. I'm trying to hold all this at the same time and get that in there. It is Oh, I got a tack on it. There's a start. There's a start right there. There's a start. Do, 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 do. Could be down there a little bit, possibly. You never know, eh? Could be down there just a little bit. <laughs> just gonna tack it on the back here somehow. That's all I wanna do. Oh. Right on. Right on. That's good. Inside brace on that piece, on that pillar, come right down, hit that tube, perfect. There you go. We're tacked in place, people. We're tacked in place. how I feel we're going with that one. Just do a little weld up here. See how that swills twist? I can bring that right up in place. Turn it up like that. Turns that sill down. Beautiful. Beautiful. You are, Jolene. Beautiful. Just tacking it all amongst this rust here. Getting some Now that that's tacked in place, ah, I wonder if I want to make a couple pieces, leave that there, and do the square tubing all the way around, or I probably square. Boom. Boom. All right, let's see this one. I'm gonna shut that off for a minute. Thank you, sweetheart. Your tape measure, we'll do the inside one. Get this one going. Sixty and a half is what I'm gonna do. Sixty and a half. I'm gonna cut this line off straighter here with the with hmm. yeah, I'm gonna stick this off straighter. <laughs> I think that even comes up higher to get that in there. We'll see when we get that piece done. Let me check it again. Oh, we better go 61. 61. We better do 61.
Beautiful outdoors. Better take that with me. And all I'm doing is looking to see where it fits in place the best. That's <laughs> the end of the story. This all has to come out of the way. See that distance right there? There's like an inch where that doesn't hit. That means I got to take an inch off where it hits, basically. Some of the ba, ba, ba. do I want to go over for there? Do I want to add on there? I don't think it matters much to be honest with you. I'm going to take a little bit off this up here, just a little bit, let it come up higher. Turn the welder on. Get the helmet on. I just found two points from the front to the back and ground all that back until it doesn't hit anymore. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the exact same thing I did on this side. Don't know if it's exactly the same as the other side. Does not matter because there's a, does not matter. Probably isn't from factory. <laughs> Let's face it, you wanna get it in the best you can, that's for sure. And what I have is it hitting at three points. I've got it hitting at the seat brace point. I've got it hitting up the front and I've got it hitting the back and that's what I want. This tells me I want to come up some to get the other side of it. Do this. How far down? Just look and see how far down I am on that side. Ugh. 
Get her connected. And... Connected in place, and then, then we'll go from there. Piece right here, I'd like to weld to that, but I guess it doesn't matter. It does not matter. Get out and take a look. Just get out and take a look. That's all I want to do. Cool. We'll run a piece across the front. We'll run a piece across the back. And that's a fact. Jack. That's a fact, Jack. It's too bad we couldn't play a little bit of music, but you couldn't hear me either. I like having music on when we're working. It's kind of nice. I got to measure it before I cut it. How's that, baby? I got to measure it before I cut it. Ah, uh, that, 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 right there. That other side, was, I must have went through for there with the square tubing. Does it look like I got it back quite a ways here? Compared to the front. And that tow board ends right about that thing right there. So that tow board, we're going to bring that down here. Yeah, that's right. We'll bring it over here. Alrighty. Twenty-one and a half. Twenty-one and a half. Twenty-one. Why is that not making me happy? That's basically what I want right there. Beautiful! All right, we'll weld this side on first. Nope. You're right, people. I will use anything for a hammer. <laughs> I will use anything for a hammer. Mm. Yeah. Here we go. It does not matter to me that the tow board's in here. I'm going to bring the tow board out here like this, like that. That can always be cut off after. doesn't matter. Not hurting anything. Beautiful. Try to give it a couple welds. 
Welder stands a little bit funny. That's the front. <laughs> that tow board seems back, seems further up, doesn't it? What? Does it? Yes or no? I have to get back and take a look. Yeah, the tow board's way further ahead. On that side there, I could run it. That don't matter at all. That don't matter at all. That don't matter at all. All right, let's go for it. Let's do another one. What I see is the tow board's... <laughs> the tow board... I'm going from this point here. Yeah, I suppose the tow board could be another bar ahead of that probably. I know what I'm going to do. Right there, I didn't get to have that long enough. I'm just going to put another one in front of that, and we'll just leave that there. Just put another piece and bring the tow board a little further ahead. There was no bar, nothing to weld it to right there to get that to stay. So I'll just bring in one, put another one there, come across, and I'll bring the tow board in that much further. Good day, good day. Uh, from the back, let's do this one. Twenty-six and a half. Twenty-six and a half. Twenty-six and a half. Uh, that front tube, toe board don't it does it bothers me a little bit. Actually, don't look that bad when I'm out here. <laughs> you know, I might be over conversing on that. Um, just want to get this in here from the back. We'll get it in here. It's tight. There we go. Now we'll draw our line and we'll weld that to it. The marker that I have in my pocket. There we go. Good enough. Good enough. I'll get the gloves back on. That gives us our back support on our floor. That gives our support over here on this side. I'm to trim that up just a bit on there here. Everything's pretty delicate until you get to a certain place. A few braces in her, and, and she's pretty delicate, but other than that, yeah. Welder. And basically, I'm going, I'm putting, I'm putting the, the square tubing, I'm putting the square tubing wherever it fits. Where, you know, I'm putting the square tubing wherever it fits. Beautiful. Yeah. Here we go. 
The reason I put that underneath there, because support for that floor, you know, gives support for that floor, obviously. Got a peephole. Weld this on and on because it looks good. It looks good. Yeah. Alrighty. So we've got her squared up somewhat. We do have her squared up. What time are we at? 56? Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Let's give away a hat or a shirt. I got it. What's that? I'll run down and get it for you. I'll run down and get it for you. Let's give away a hat or a shirt. Any more than that, it gets to be it gets to be too long. I can put more pieces in. Yes, I can. And I probably should. But we'll go down and get the computer and we'll give a hat or a shirt away to whoever likes it. But we got it framed up now, so the I'm not sure if I'll change that or not. I might kick that back a little bit because that tow board looks like it's in a little bit further. And that's pretty, basically pretty easy now that I've got a piece of metal there. I just cut that off and add to it, right? I've got something to add to. I've got it squared off on this side for underneath the door. I've got it welded on the tunnel there, welded up to the front of the tunnel there. We'll put the metal on exactly like we got going on the other side. Exact same thing. Man, we got the pattern hurt here. Pattern don't look so good anymore. I gotta get her unlodged there. There we go. Now it fits better. Anyways, we put the metal along here. We'll do the exact same thing on this side. Uh, we'll do the exact same thing along there. We'll do the exact same thing back there. We'll put a piece in there and uh, we'll show you the whole process. But I've really got to go get a, the computer right at the present second. <laughs> it's a beautiful day. Me and Jolene were playing with the old 62 last night, weren't we, baby? Huh? I could take these glasses on. I'll never see the house. Right. I'll be right back. It's always good to work hard and then go for a run. <laughs> I'm hoping it's right there. I got the computer. Having fun driving the old gas guzzler, aren't we? $15 going to minus and back, boys. $15. It's can we stay home, drink a case of beer, or do we want to go to town and have a coffee? But same thing, isn't it? Already we'll put the computer up on the car here. And we'll see if we'll give away a hat or a shirt to a nice comment that was given yesterday. We'll give a hat away. Ah, yeah, I could have ran that up in there a little further. I see now. I think I will. And I think I will. That was yesterday's. Today, we're going to do a new one on yesterday's video. Bear with us. We'll see who the winner is. Baby got the computer all looking good. Me and Joan, Bad Chad and Jolene on YouTube. Good job. Look at that, would you? Our friendly neighborhood crow. Tomorrow we'll put the 
we'll, we'll make all the metal that goes all the way around the outside of the square tubing. We'll make that all the way around. And then, and then it'll be cross members. There might be even inside sill before we do any of it. <laughs> I might just go inside sill. Oh, 725. 725 comments. Wow. Thank you very much. I think yesterday's video uh, touched some chords in a few places, you know what I mean? If we got 725, you know, that's good. It's awesome. <laughs> Printer Man, 1977. Dolly Parton sang the song, Code of, Many, uh, Code of Many Colors, but great show and great job on the floor. Well, I just give you another one to write another comment. Remember, Achy Breaky Heart by Miley Cyrus? Three in a row, there's no, after three, I begin to come back, see? So thank you for commenting and appreciate you watching. Tell your friends, tell whoever, and subscribe. It's a good channel for nothing but other than information. <laughs>